Mind altering. TV. We don't just tell it, we show it. Show it, show it, show it. Ah, ish, ish. Trumpia, I think I did it. Skim some psyche and a no, no, no. We can do it. Skim some. Baba, skim some. There's a whole lot of stats, eh? Um. I can I can safely say that like uh, since I also am a DJ, I listen to a whole lot of music and um, being also a music connoisseur, I had to like you know go and listen to you know your old school vinyls, yes vinyl not MP3s vinyls, um, try and search for new sounds or old sounds that can be recreated to new and then I started from there chopping samples and then aligning them properly starting to work on the drums if the drums are not dry have to go back chop wherever I need to chop again to just fit the drums and call up uh, a couple of session musicians let them replay or play whatever that needs to be added and boom i have an instrumental well i get inspired from anything and everything at any given moment i don't know when my inspiration kicks in so i just work and let me see where i come up with and then at some moments you find that like there's that lucky spot that bright spark of inspiration that just you know glistens uh and highlights you into something else and you find now you have too much inspiration you're building on certain drums that you were doing or certain frames of of elements of music that you were doing to actually create something you know, solid. I'm not a superstar, 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 I just play whatever that I think will be the right note and after that um, create a, a, an instrument, an instrumental from that. Um, if ever I feel that like you know it can add on, I can add on like a sparkle or perfect it, that's when like I get um, session musicians and then let them actually create what I need, need in specific elements of the the music itself and then yeah take it from there okay um regarding my sound mm, how do i describe it most of my, oh, the elements that i have um are based on the 90s feel i'm an 80s born kid and when I started like you know loving music that's when like the 90s were there uh, it came to a point whereby I wanted for that sound to be in me even if like it's in 10 20 30 or whatever years to come and I just wanted to share with people how I actually perceive uh, uh, um, music to to be like now when i produce everything that i that i touch it has to have you know that 90 sound despite it having maybe a couple of new stuff or new elements here and there but yeah it has to have like you know hard kicks hard snares dirty drums all over and then it has to have that sample feel in it that's basically that. Um, the faculty consists of myself, Trumpy, um, Tony Mac, and J Smalls. Um, how it actually got formate, uh, formated 
um, I was just chilling like with Toadie, um, who were just playing beats, playing beats. And since that, like we we know our sound, we know our style. He was like, you know, let's do something very different. Let's go out there and challenge any other production team. Like, okay, that's cool, but. Since that, like we're from the 90s, we need something new, we, we need something fresh. He asked me who I actually recommend, and that's when I introduced him to Jay Smalls. Um, from there, you know what? We've been bouncing ideas thanks to the internet um, because, like, most of us can't actually be at the same place at the same time, it's very rare, but we work together all the time. Um, it came to a point where we started like you know doing beats saving them up just so like you know we have a whole lot of material that we can actually punt out in the future and it can last us as long as we want to we haven't actually been sitting with artists and recording them like constantly we just do what of what we have to do and yeah that's what's up. Yeah. Stuff I'm working on. Uh, I've been working on a couple of projects. I've been working on um, the Ben Academy album. The Ben Academy is, is a conglomerate of musicians everywhere in the world. Um, though the very first part of the Ben Academy consists of myself, uh, Les B. Skilo and L Skills. Um, that's the better can Band Academy, and then uh, that's there's another lesson two from Tody Mac. I'm working on that also. I'm working on Morafe's album. I'm working on KG's album. I'm working on Mavtan Heights compilation. I'm working on my own album, which is Condo Music. I'm working also on like a remix project I haven't named it as yet as yet uh, I remix a whole lot of stuff um, probably like I'll play you something that I remixed I just remixed um, I um, Millie um, I'm working on um, tributes tribute is a jazz musician of mine that is signed under me She's a jazz musician, and I'm working on an album. I'm working on um, an artist slash DJ, uh, first Indian DJ slash rapper in SA called uh, DJ Roxy. I'm working on her mini album. Um, yeah, that's that's what I can think of currently. So, yeah, there's a whole lot of things that I'm, I have my hands in. This is like an exclusive, like I funny um, melee remix. Have half a million, 